I got this car kit for Christmas, four wheel drive car kit. A little Mechatronics project. Has two of these, they're Adreno boards, who knows, but Free Nova brand with hats. Some motors, some parts, and I'm just assembling the motor to the base right now. These are little brackets. So that's so far is what I got. Here's the other board. Um, yeah, and I'm just gonna document on the, along the way, I guess. Stay tuned. I have all four motors and wheels mounted now. Oh, and also this tracking sensor. We'll find out what, uh, what that sort of does, but uh, that's what I have. So far, so good. It's pretty cute, pretty cute. I have the board and the hat installed with some other components servo um, this part is the ultrasonic proximity sensor attached to it and then it can rotate from the servo so that's where i am as of right now I'll just keep on trucking along so i have the everything built the construction built i uploaded the code to use the um Infrared remote. There's other ways. Like there's, it comes with a, um, a, a, a Arduino Uno for a remote controller, I think. But you can use the infrared. But it's all built, so I just have to upload what code I want. And it's just plugged into the computer right now, so the lights are on to upload the code. And then I'll hook up the batteries and test it out. Yep. Yeah. Cool. 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 Well, it's stuck, but it's supposed to be semi-autonomous. Oh, I see. Uses ultrasonic proximity sensor. Oh, no, it didn't work that time. Oh, the corner maybe we messed it up. Oh, there we go. Seems to be stuck under there. There we go. Pretty cool ultrasonic, the ultrasonic proximity sensor. Scan in, see if it hit. Oh, hit me. Way. Works pretty good. I, there's one that's a tape tracker. So I have the, the tracking the line. Works pretty good. I thought it might not work because of the tight corners. Might come off track though after a bit, but. Works pretty decently. I have the RF controller, as you can see here. I built this part of the package and uh, has an Arduino Uno too. Pretty cool. Has the lights and everything. Yeah, pretty sweet. Okay, um, on the computer, I have the tutorial. The tutorial link is on the box of the kit. And then you just download a... Um, uh, a zip file and then unzip it and here 
is the directory, so the tutorial. The sketches is where the Arduino code is for each um, function. Automatic tracking line. I think I have it open, but yeah. This one was the black tape with a white background and it tracks it with the sensors on the car. And uh, I think here is the the code uh, for that. This one is for the controller and then multifunction means it has lights, it, uses, it has lights. Um, but all the code just worked, I uploaded it. I got some uh, warnings I found out, I thought they were errors, so I was trying to figure out what they were. Then I realized it worked, it was just warnings. I think it's just with the variable names, but it works, so it's good. And um, one step that had to be done was to install these libraries on the Arduino IDE. So you have uh, include, you know, these libraries. You, you would go here, include, add library, and then you find them from here. Yeah. Oops. And then you add each one. I already did them, so I don't need to. And um, if you go here, manage libraries, and then this is where you can um, uninstall and uninstall libraries you need. That's pretty cool. And yeah, so that's the tutorial PDF here is pretty good. So you had to build it. It has a lot of um, theory in there too, like how electric motors work. Gives you good background. But all in all, pretty good project. I like it. And uh, um, thanks for watching and uh, talk to you later.